James had always been a high achiever. He was top of his class in school, captain of the football team, and had a full scholarship to attend a prestigious university. But when he graduated and started his first job, James quickly realized that success in the real world was not as easy as it had been in school. He faced challenges he had never experienced before, and he struggled to adapt to the fast-paced, competitive environment of his new workplace. One day, James was assigned a project that he felt confident about. He poured his heart and soul into it, working long hours and sacrificing his weekends to make sure it was perfect. But when he presented his work to his boss, he was met with disappointment and criticism. James was devastated. He had always been a high achiever and had never experienced failure before. But now he had failed, and he didn't know how to handle it. Over the next few days, James wallowed in self-pity, replaying the events of the project over and over in his mind. But then he realized that he had to do something different. He couldn't change the past, but he could learn from it. James decided to analyze his mistakes and figure out what he could do differently next time. He sought feedback from his boss and colleagues, and he worked hard to improve his skills and knowledge in the areas where he had fallen short. Over time, James began to see the fruits of his efforts. He became more confident and skilled in his work, and he began to receive recognition and praise from his boss and colleagues. But more importantly, James learned a valuable lesson about failure. He learned that failure was not something to be feared, but something to be embraced. Failure was an opportunity to learn, grow, and become a better version of himself. From that day on, James approached every challenge with a new mindset. He knew that he might fail again, but he also knew that he had the power to turn that failure into something positive and valuable.